morning saturday morning i'm gonna turn these guys back out in here it was a little rainy the other day got this set up for now I'm gonna do some more and uh they're liking it getting to get out in the sun enjoying that i'm gonna get their area cleaned out in here today so they're eating their grain good getting on it so that's a good thing cut them off on the bottles they're not needing it so pretty happy with with them here so they're eating starter and eating hay so it's uh Right here, and I'll show you another project. Of course, these mutts. Ugh. So there's a well, shallow well in the barn, and I went to fire it up, trying to pump up and everything to fire it up. This is the one that was on it, and of course, it must have froze some point and it was leaking water so I took it apart somewhere in here right inside this deal here is broke the impellers broke allowing the water to leak all over the place so I had to go to Menards and pick up a new pump and tank because just the pump for it was 200 and some bucks the pump and tank was a little bit more so anyways that's what we got. Everybody in here is doing good. I'm going to do a pen cleaning on them today. So I'm going to get that done. Get the water hooked up. What's up, Brutus? Huh? Brutus doing good? Yeah. Yeah, Brutus is doing good. Lucky number seven over here. He's doing really good. Huh, number seven? Uh, yeah, this one we thought wasn't going to make it, and he's doing really good. Really, really good. Oh, huh, buddy. Yeah, you're doing all right over here. Yeah, uh-huh. Yep. So, everybody's doing good. Then yesterday when Menards went ahead and got a hot water tank two to go in the milk house here so we're gonna hook that up over here where the hot water tank's supposed to go everything's there wires lines just gotta build a little stand to put it on apparently there was one here at one time but it's not there anymore so and i'm not putting a big one up there because i don't feel i need it for the little bit of water I'm going to be using for washing bottles and stuff. <laughs> so I'm just going to put this six gallon one up and uh, call her good. It ain't fancy, but it'll work. So, other than that, that's going to be the day. I'm probably going to end up having to go to town and get some more cat started. Yeah, so it rained. We had about, I don't know, inch and a half, two inches of rain. And you see, it's pretty wet still. So it started, I don't know if you can see out there, started bottom plowing that. There's about, I don't know, six eight acres out there i haven't looked i gotta look at the map again to see what it's drawn out at but we're gonna see about putting that in corn so i went out there and started bottom plowing that and it's still too wet so and the rain on top of it didn't help but i started getting more of this cleaned up through here a little bit at a time cleaning this up and boy i'm finding all kinds of stuff i don't know if you can see it but right there there's another great 
that was in here for going over the barn cleaner. <coughs> Took a bucket out of here and I went to dump it out and I heard a thunk on the bucket and next thing you know there's a barn clean or a barn clean out grate there so look like it's all intact. I'm gonna pull it out of there and uh get it using but that's about it. We had a bunch of turkeys out there today. The deer kind of been moving out there. Not as much of them out there eating on my hay field, which is a good thing. But that's the day. Just wanted to do a quick video and tell everybody happy Saturday morning. Beautiful day out today. And uh, we'll holler at you later.